you don't, you know, it's gonna catch you like uh, unawares. That's all. This, this is what's coming. Right here. These people, they're trying to get into a, a supermarket. But they're being uh, uh, stopped from going into that grocery market because they can't prove that their their uh, potion status. Yeah. Yeah. This is in France. Yeah. Yeah. So no that's when it, that's when it come global, man. France, France is part of the beast, man. Part of the beast, man. They were saying over here at uh, at uh, what's this, Allegiant Stadium? Yeah. The Raiders they did uh, oh, yeah. um, SummerSlam last night. They said that shit was an epic fail. Like nothing worked. They couldn't read people's uh, jab status. They couldn't, um, the bathroom didn't work. A whole bunch of other food wasn't enough food. The, the payment system was down. All kinds of things, man, going wrong in there. Yeah, they got some shit now. I was in the airport, and they got some shit where you put your products on this little square, and somehow the computer reads all that shit, and you just pay with the little, little yeah. kiosk. That shit was crazy. You just put put it right there and it reads everything. You don't have to touch nothing. Just put it on the thing. That's doing away with jobs too. Yep. Revelation 3 and 10. Because thou hast kept thy word of, thy, of my patience, I will also keep thee from the hour of temptation, which shall come upon all the world to try them that dwell upon the earth. I was gonna say that that's the uh that's the Really, what we're talking about. Man, I hope y'all, I hope y'all be aware later on tonight when uh, the brothers and sisters, the brothers and Chris be get, be getting murdered out this motherfucker all night. Yeah. When they raping blacks at them 7-Eleven, ain't nobody out here to fight. Revelation 3 and 10, because thou hast kept the word of my patience, I also will keep thee from the hour of temptation, which shall come upon Ignore the demon. Which shall come upon all the world to try them that dwell upon the earth. To try this temptation is coming to try everybody. Okay, the things that we're really talking about is that temptation coming to you. The more that they take away your civil liberties and your, your personal rights and your general rights, the more you're going to be tempted to fall in order with what they got going on. Yeah, yeah the, more, the more restrictions that they impose upon you, it's like Esau's turning up the fire, man. Yeah. Yep. yep. You know? Oh, they, 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 they not... All right, turn, turn the fire up some more. Esau's turning turn, up... Turn, 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 turn it up. Turn it to 350. Yeah. Like, like, are they are they still not budging? Oh, oh turn wow. it up to 450. Yeah. Jake's is the frog yeah. in the pot. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Scared yeah. to jump out. It's scared to jump out. Yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. Jake, man. It is funny because the example came by, right? This nigga completely carnal, right? Yeah. He, he don't understand. We're not out here to fight lonely street thugs and shit like that. That's not what we're out here for. We're out here against the elites at the top of the food chain. We're at the top of the, the spiritual food chain, fighting those at the top of the car food chain. That's low level shit, that's for you to have to deal with. The Lord wants you low levels to deal with that. If you ain't fit for that, you better get in the spiritual war. But you gotta, you gonna have to strap up and, uh, with, 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 either with wisdom, or you gonna get laid down. Pure point blank, if you're not strapped up with this, the wisdom of your house by some you you gonna get laid down. And they out here raping people down low. Okay, let's go stop. Stop doing it. Well, he, Stop, he, you know? yeah, he, he was on something. You know? He was yeah, on heavy, something. Heavy, heavy d on But see, if they're worrying about that shit, you got UN troops in the country. Thank you. So you that, got, you, yeah. Esau is, is, is deploying all type of military equipment yeah. all throughout the country. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, 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 MRAPs, yeah. Humvees, yeah. tanks. Yeah. They're, they're just being just deployed all throughout the, the country right now. What do you think they're gearing up for? Mm-hmm. Well, they finna set up a, 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 a <laughs> What you think they finna do, man? The right. crazy part about it, martial law comes, man. We, we ain't talked about martial law in depth in a while, not that we have to now, but just simply saying, you people forgot martial law coming. We don't give a damn what's happening on these streets, man. Only thing good happening on these streets is us. Now's the time for us to, uh, to be out here pushing this with them to get you Get this in your minds, man. Once, once the, the martial law comes, why would we be out? It's time to sweep the street. They're going to put a tank at the corner. 
and they're going to line up troops with all types of riot gear to sweep everybody the hell up off the street. They're going to have those, those big cement barricades yep. where, you know, out of deconstruction, you can't go down this street. The only street you can go down is the one that they won't allow you to go down. Yep. You know how they break, uh, cut off the strip during yep. New Year's? Yep. Same thing. You know, uh -huh. they will have their little, uh, uh, little headquarters and shit yep. right in your Command neighborhood. Center. Command yep. center right in your neighborhood. And, and, and the police, the local metro police, wherever you at, they can't do shit about it because they gonna be under the rule of the uh, martial law. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. y'all better go watch that movie, The Siege. If you remember in that movie, The Siege, he goes, "Hey, what are you doing?" He said, "Hey, I got you don't have jurisdiction. I'm the head commander." He goes, "Well, I got orders from the president that yeah. supersedes your command." Uh, uh, Bruce Willis, right? Yeah, Bruce yeah. Willis came in and let him know. But what did he tell him? You don't want this on these streets. But when he got it, he went hard, man. Yeah, yeah, he went hard. Yeah, he, he, he yeah. went straight with the, the letter of the law city. They're not going to eat in nothing. You, you, know know how, you know how they got the, uh, the troop there, like riot police? They're yeah. just they going to be going full force at you, yeah, motherfuckers, man. man. You saw in the movie, they was going door to door. Yeah. yeah. They was snatching them towel heads out. Yep. And they was putting them in those uh, concentration camps, man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. But so the 16, what am I going to do? So who do yeah. you think is going in those concentration camps now? Right. The ones with the, that's un... That's that, and then, and then yeah. anybody uncompliant going yep. on to a separate group. Yeah, because yeah. as far as they're concerned, if you're against these measures and yeah. you're uh, not jabbed, you're basically you're uh, you're a terrorist. They're gonna treat they're gonna treat you like you're the Taliban. Is it you know? Straight up, they gonna they they finna they finna start treating uh, you everyday citizens yeah. that's not complying with with their orders. They're gonna treat you like you're the Taliban. Yeah. You know. Terrorists. Yeah, that's what they finna do, and, and guess but what? And because of that, they gonna be justified in yep. snatching you up, putting you in in, in, in one of them cattle trucks, yep. and shipping you over to uh, the nearest uh, 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 FEMA center, man. What did that guy concentration camp? What did that guy say? I forgot. I think it was in Oklahoma. He said they just gonna put you in a bus, and you ain't gonna know where you're going. Yep. Yeah, they just gonna throw your ass in a bus. And you right. know it ain't gonna be like no school bus. Them, them windows ain't gonna yeah. be open. You ain't gonna be able to go out the emergency exit. It's one way in the bus, one way out. Families gonna be yeah. separated. Yep, hell yeah. yeah. Like in uh, yeah. North. They, they put you in, yeah. a, uh, in one meat wagon going east. Your, your your sons and daughter and wife going another way. Yep. And they yeah. they show that in all the movies where <laughs> somehow some way the kids are separated from the parents yep. and the, you know the movie is all set on them trying to get back together. But that's a movie. We're talking about reality. Reality is you may not see your loved ones again. You may not see your children again. That's reality. Or get that in uh second oh, get, get, get that in uh Deuteronomy 28. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You talk about when you know, get children. Yeah. And I'm talking about in, in the, the siege. Yeah. Oh yeah, 50, uh, 54, I think 50, 52 or something over there. There's a bunch of things that we talk about what we're talking about in, in curses. Because they have been uh, various oh, times throughout yeah. our history. Yep. Oh, they got the, someone get that one. I'm gonna get the one that does. This one is the one. 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 Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 52. Yep. And he shall besiege thee in all thy gates, until thy high and fence walls come down, wherein thou trustest throughout all thy land. That thou trustest throughout all thy land, and he shall besiege thee in all thy gates throughout all thy land, which the Lord thy power hath given thee. Siege. They're going to put that seed, that's, and that's basically martial law. Yeah, I got one. Here it is. And, and if you can, jump up to uh, uh, verse 41. Yep. Verse 41. Thou shalt beget sons and daughters, but thou shalt not enjoy them, for they shall go into captivity. Now, what is, what is, what is another term for captivity? Imprisonment. Imprisonment. 
So when you say if you in a concentration camp, you in a place, a holding place, where you just confined for a, a long while, you not say that you're in captivity, yeah. you're in prison. So hey, we've experienced that even in our history. Well, if you if 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 Esau deems your your family or household uh, a family of terrorists. This is what they're gonna do. They're gonna put you in captivity. They're gonna deliver you to, to uh, into prison. I just heard down there in uh, Australia, there was a there was a uh, there was a guy down there that basically uh, he tested positive, so they ended up um, taking him to a, a, a quarantine center, and he actually uh, broke quarantine and actually left. So what, what what they put out for him was a, 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 a arrest warrant. They issued an arrest warrant, man. So if, basically, if you try to leave and you think you're gonna just be like, man, fuck, I'm not gonna be up in here. And you try to you know escape and hop the fence and leave, well, they they gonna put put that that warrant out for you. Because they, they do like they, more than likely they do a count. Yeah. They got some kind of record or some kind of. Eventually, it's gonna be the MOTB, but they're gonna have some kind of wristband where they could keep, you know, a, a, a electronic electric, electronic record on me, right? New York yeah. City number one. Yeah, yeah. They, they, yeah. they gonna keep yeah. a count. They gonna keep a count. Yeah. On prisoners. Hey, he, he, the, the, the dude is wanted. They, they, and I, I have a feeling that when they catch this dude, um, it, it might be, it might be a rap for dude, man. But you already see how they treating people in the street. Yeah. How they just, you know, you ain't got your mask on. They smack you on the ground like, like as if you yeah. stole something. As if you was a, they treat you like you're a criminal just because you're not following the measures. There was and an argument saying that, that they would, they, they should be uh, treated as terrorists and criminals and like like the same as murderers because you're pushing out something that can kill people. Ex exactly. Oh, and exactly. And so now now you got to be treated like you're in an escaped prisoner. Yeah. You know. What they're also doing is they're making fugitive every, every all the civilians police everybody. Yep. Yeah. Right. You know, so you know, it's someone that's potentially infected in my building, yada yada yada, and everyone's policing everyone. So and that, but that goes to what the scripture said: the love of many shall wax cold. Neighbors shall turn against neighbors. You know, friends shall betray one, betray one another. Huh? You know, you had down there in Brazil, a, a dude oh, yeah. killed a, a, a couple yeah, because he blamed them for infecting his his uh, father, father and you know, his son and his son, yeah. and they ended up dying. Yeah. You know. So that's hey, it's, it's it's getting to that point, and I and I saw those. Uh, I don't know where this was at. I think this was in the states though, but in these quarantine centers, they have these holding cells that they're gonna put people in. And when you look at how they're built, they look they look like the very thing. That, um, like when you go to pr uh, prison, and let's say if you get into a fight or oh, you yeah. do some shit in there, and they put you in solitary confinement, which they call it the hole. Them holding centers basically look like the hole. Yeah. You know? So so just imagine they finna they, they finna put your ass in the hole because you ain't got that the beetle juice. Yeah. Look what Instacar going yeah. on. It's been happening in Instacar the past three years down in the border. Yeah. They done put them in cages and shit. Yeah. That's just a precursor to what's gonna happen, you know, once uh this shit really kick off. I don't remember, I think I know which one you're talking about, but it's like damn it's 20 minutes. shall cast some of you into prison that ye may be tried and ye shall have you're tribulation gonna 10 days yeah you're gonna be tested you're gonna be in there and you're gonna be like especially if you've never been to prison you been used to that condition man. you know what I mean 
This ain't no spot where you can bring your, your Xbox up in there. Yeah, okay. But you can just be occupying and be like, oh shit, let me 